Hi everyone, my name is Marina and I'm very happy to see you here. Welcome to this grounding, peaceful, feel-good flow for full body stretch. Deep breaths and slow movements. If you are ready, let us begin this practice in a standing position. Softly close your eyes and take a slow inhale followed by a slow exhale. Notice that the more focused you become on your breathing, the easier it is to become present, aware of all your thoughts, aware of all the distractions, and at the same time, more capable of letting them go, setting them aside while you are on your mat. Already now, appreciate all the change that you are going to create. Inhale, sweep the arms up and lengthen. Deep exhale, release the arms through the sides and down. Two more times, breathe deep. <sighs> inhale, reach the arms up. Bring the hands to the shoulders and draw a few big circles through the elbows. Now the opposite direction. Release. Inhale, reach through the arms up. Interlace the fingers. Your feet are comfortably hip distance apart. We'll go for a full circle through the back. Might be reaching just halfway forward. Finding the length through the spine. And trying to keep the chest wide open as we are reaching through the sides. Two more circles this direction. And now the opposite way. And back to the center. Exhale. We'll go for a few side bends. Left the arm is reaching over the head. Keep the chest open. Back to the center. Step the left foot across. Right arm is reaching to the left. Chest open. Back to the center. A few more times. Side bend to the right. Left foot steps across. Side bend to the left. One more time this way. And now let's change the sides. Side bend over to the left, right arm is reaching over the head. Step the right foot forward, left arm over the head. Two more times here. Beautiful stretch. 
Root through the feet into the floor, engage into the glutes, open through the chest as you reach backwards. And on the exhale, soften into the knees, fold forward, stomach closer to the thighs, relax the head down. Two more times, roll up, inhale into the standing back bend. Exhale, softly bend into your knees and fold forward. One more time here. And inhale, roll up to standing. Reach through the arms up, interlace the fingers and place the hands behind your head. Tuck the chin to the chest, put some pressure with your hands onto the back of your head. And now begin to slowly round into your upper back, middle back. If it feels good, keep the knees softly bent and fold as deep as it feels right for you. We want to feel the stretch through the entire back. Whenever you are ready, slowly roll back up to standing and open through the chest. Interlace the fingers behind the back, squeeze the shoulder blades closer together. Exhale, standing forward fold, allow your arms to open over your head, relax into your neck, into your shoulders, and then slowly roll up to standing. Well done. Let's come together at the front of the mat. Inhale, reach through the arms up. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, lift halfway up. Exhale, step back, plank. Inhale. Exhale, knees, chest and chin to the floor. Inhale, lift up, cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. Hold it here for a few breaths. Inhale, step forward to the front of the mat. Exhale, fold forward. Inhale, roll up to stand and sweep the arms up. Exhale, hands to the heart center. Inhale, reach your arms up. Exhale, stand and forward fold. Inhale, half lift. Exhale, plank. Inhale. Exhale, knees, chest and chin or chaturanga. Inhale, lift up, cobra. Exhale, downward facing dog. With the next exhale, bring your knees down into the tabletop position. Let's continue with a few cat and cow rounds. On the inhale, lift through the chest, tailbone up. Exhale, round into your back. A few more times, follow your breathing.
Wonderful! Back in the tabletop position, Hill will be circling one arm at a time, opening wide across the chest. And then on the other side, the hand that remains on the floor is actively pushing the mat away from you. You're finding the space across the collarbones. And you're drawing a big circle through the arm a few more times. Well done! Now extend your left leg back, right arm forward. Release and change sides, right leg back, left arm forward. Let's go through a few more of these changes. Trying to find stability through the center of the body. So instead of sinking down through the lower back, hug the navel in, engage into your core, lift through the center of the chest up. Finding the length and strength in the simple movements. Hold it here. Hold a little bit longer on the other side. Your leg is active and strong. Release. Beautiful. Lower down onto the tummy, coming into the sphinx pose. Elbows underneath your shoulders or might be slightly farther forward. Draw the shoulders back and down, lift up through the chest. You can choose to slightly pull the hands back towards your feet, awakening the energy through your back. Exhale, release. Bring your hands next to the chest. On the inhale, roll up into a cobra position. Exhale, release. Two more times with your breathing. Try to keep the shoulders down, away from the ears. And think of all the space that you can create across the chest. Now push yourself up and back into the downward facing dog. Very good. Bring your knees down and step the right foot forward towards the front of the mat. Low kneeling lunge. Make space for your hips to sink down and on the inhale lift up through the chest. Hug the stomach in. Reach through the arms up. Continue breathing. Exhale, twisted lunge, lift the left knee up, open through the right arm up. Perfect, come back into the low kneeling lunge, inhale, lift through the arms up, gaze up. Exhale, hands to the heart. 
Press the palms together as you twist to the right. Left elbow is pressing on the outside of your right knee. Keep the shoulders down. Inhale, reach back and up to the center. Exhale, take your hands to the floor and shift back into a half split position. Flex into the right foot and lengthen forward through your back, feeling for a good stretch through the back of your right leg. Now shift forward, lizard lunge position with both of your hands to the left of the right foot. Relax into your hips and once again lift through the chest up. Now step back into the plank, go through a vinyasa flow. to come back into the downward facing dog. We'll repeat the stretches on the other side. Bring your knees towards the floor and now step the left foot forward to the front of the mat. Inhale, lift up. If you are ready, sweep through the arms upwards. Now transition into the twisted lunge. Right hand to the floor, lift the right knee up and twist to the left, left arm is reaching up towards the skies. Release and come back up into the low kneeling lunge. Exhale, hands to the heart and twist to the left. Active twist as you press the palms together and as you press the right elbow against the left leg. Inhale, lift up one more time. And exhale, shift back into the half splits. Flex the left foot and reach through the chest and chin forward. Connect to your breathing. Shift forward, lizard lunge, both of the hands to the right of the left foot. Just a few breaths here. Inhale, step back into the plank. Exhale, Chaturanga. Inhale, lift up, Cobra. And exhale into the child's pose. Soften and relax. If you already come up onto your knees, 
On the inhale, we'll take a heart opening camel position with the hands sliding on the back of your legs. And on the exhale, we'll round into the back. And we'll shift back and forward a few more times with your own breathing and bringing beautiful movement into our back. Gentle spinal waves. One last time here. Absolutely amazing. Let's come up into downward facing dog one last time. Notice how it feels. Appreciate even the smallest change that you feel in your body. Inhale, step forward to the front of the mat. And on the exhale, come down into the chair. Hold it here, deep inhale. And on the next exhale, lift up to standing, come up onto the tippy toes. Squeeze the inner thighs, glutes, engage into the core to find your balance. And then come back into the chair a few more times, holding each position for a little bit. On to the tippy toes. Into the chair. One more time on the tippy toes. Chair. One last time, lift up onto the tippy toes. And now begin to slowly bend into your knees as you maintain your balance, lowering as close to the floor as possible, and then making your way all the way down onto the mat. Well done. Extend the legs in front of you. On the inhale, lengthen. Exhale, seated forward fold. Choose any modification that works well for you so that you feel a beautiful stretch through the entire backside of your body. Focus on your slow, deep breathing. Inhale, lift up to seated, bend the right knee up, we'll go for the Lord of the Fishes twist, lengthen and then twist to the right, left elbow on the outside of the right knee, sit tall as you find the length through the back.
gently reach forward and drop the right knee down and to the side. Inhale, lift up and into the side body stretch. So try to keep your right hip, right knee closer to the floor and find the length through the right side of your body. Keep the chest open, hold and breathe through the stretch that you feel. Inhale to come upright. Let's change the sides. Bend the left knee. Left hand behind your back might be on the fingertips. Inhale, lengthen. Exhale, twist to the left. Come forward, drop the left knee down and to the side and go for a side body stretch. Rise up to seated and now make your way down onto your back. We'll take a happy baby pose. You can bring your peace fingers around the big toes. Open the knees out to the sides and down to the floor. Try to keep your lower back and your hips closer to the mat. Feeling for the inner thigh and hip stretch. Release the clasp and hug both of the knees towards you. You can choose to lift the forehead up towards your knees. Release. Extend the left leg down, keep hugging the right knee towards the chest. Change sides, draw the left knee towards you, right leg is straight down on the floor. And release. Extend your legs and your arms down on the mat. Arriving into the final relaxation pose of this practice. Take a deep breath. Even deeper exhale. Let it all go once again. Everything that has been on your mind recently, let it go. Focus on what is really important right now. 
and that is how you feel and what's happening in your body. Right now you feel absolutely relaxed, soft, at peace. You can notice warm energy flowing through your body. There is nothing to worry about. This moment is absolutely perfect and you are exactly where you need to be right now. Allow yourself just a little bit longer to feel that your heart is overwhelmed with gratitude, love, and kindness, despite any challenges that you might be going through. Take a few more deep breaths. If you are ready to finish this practice, bring a little movement into your body. Stretch it out as you reach the arms over the head. Roll through the right side. And then slowly come up into the cross-legged seated position. Another breath here. Inhale, reach your arms up and over your head. Exhale, hands to the heart center. The light within me honors the light within you. Namaste. Thank you so much for choosing to complete this practice with me. If you enjoyed this class, remember to hit that like button, subscribe to my channel, leave me a comment, that will really mean a lot to me. I remember that consistency brings results and creates a beautiful change that we are all seeking. So I cannot wait to see you back on the mat. Until then, take care of yourself and much love.